Through These Doors is presented by Gate City Bank. What can be done today to create a better way of life? We can end hunger, homelessness, and violence. Acts of kindness, compassion, and teamwork bring us together and keep our community safe. Every day at Gate City Bank, we're building a better tomorrow and a better way of life. First, let's start with the four one C's. And no surprise here, the number one overall seed, it is North Dakota. It was cool to watch that selection show with all, all the guys at the rink there. But, um, I mean, we knew we were going to be in Fargo. So, and we weren't sure who we were going to play. But, you know, our, our mindset right now is, is to just, it doesn't matter who we play. We need to worry about, you know, like our game and um, coming out and performing how like we know how to play. Coach Jax was like, he, he's all business and all you guys kind of burst out laughing at him. Um, do, does Coach Jackson like uh, kind of throw out jokes all the time uh, about Brad like that? Good luck to you. You got a great squad. You're fun to watch and uh, hope to see you in Pittsburgh. Thanks, fellas. Here is the <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, not not about Bob spe specifically, but uh, Jax is... Yeah, he's a character. He's a, a funny coach and a great guy, but he uh he likes to throw little comments like that, like the the bubs comment or um I don't know, just little things like in practice like coffee's free. So he he, he always does those, but uh, yeah, it's just who Jax is. It was an unforgettable frozen face-off in Grand Forks. UND jumped out of the gates with a hot start, scoring four goals in the first period on the way to a 6-2 win in the quarterfinal. Here comes Kalaguchi across the line. Adams going to that end. He got it to Adams. He scores! Deep left backhander, 14 seconds in. How about that? It's one nothing. UND. Our first game, um... You know, we kind of just preached, and Brad uh, preached to, you know, get the first goal and uh, start fast. And, uh, yeah, that's exactly what we did, I think. That last game against Miami, I guess, was, you know, it was the first game of the playoffs, and we didn't get to play in the playoffs last year. So I think a lot of the guys were pretty fired up, and, you know, just to have the, the chance to go out there and play this year. So, um, you know, I think we took advantage of it, and you could tell everyone was ready with that start. The Fighting Hawks endured a hard-hitting battle in the semifinal against Denver, ending in an overtime thriller. Tobisto's yeah! yeah! out, here's the shot and a goal by Hayne! Just as Tobisto came out, Gavin Hayne picked up a loose puck in the face-off circle and drilled it by Corona, and North Dakota wins it in overtime. We had a game plan tonight, he executed it. Didn't go the right way offensively, right? But that's what happens in hockey sometimes, right? Tomorrow it's gonna to go the right way from day from minute one, all right? Dale, great job. Yeah, yeah it was fun. Obviously we do that kind of every game. Uh, some guys are better uh, speakers than most. Um, I'm up there with uh, the not so good speakers. So <laughs> they kind of knew that, so that brought in a little humor, but. Uh, yeah. <laughs> what a battle at the end there. Uh, we never gave up. Uh, we got one more tomorrow. Finally, it was St. Cloud State in the championship where Reese Gaber and Jordan Kawaguchi stole the show. Oh, yeah! Gaber 
out near the blue line, top of the slot. Toe dag around one. He's going to walk right in. They're going to draw a penalty and score. Play made by Gaber off his stick right to Kawaguchi, who shelved it. I mean, that was a big game for, for us in the program. Uh, you know, UND's never won uh, the frozen faceoff in the NCHC anyways. Um, so, you know, we wanted to be that team to, one, win it for the first time in program history, but also in the NCHC history, be the first team to win the Penrose and the playoff trophy. So, you know, like we were down in that game as well, but uh, that locker room between the second and third period, we could kind of talk and you could tell guys that like we were going to come out and win that game. It was just kind of a feeling that we we had. There was never really a, a doubt in that game. So, you know, I mean, we just stuck it out and I'm proud of the guys the way they showed up in that game. Next on the docket, American International in the NCAA Midwest Regional in Fargo. So today we have kind of need to be a quarantine in the hotel or whatnot. So, um, I mean, I've done some schoolwork at a test today, but you know, in the off time we went out and played lightning. They got a basketball court uh, right out of the hotel. So uh, a bunch of the guys went out there were playing basketball today. And, uh, we've seen some Michigan guys out there too, so we try to <laughs> not go to the court when they're there. But um, yeah, we've been doing what we can to stay busy. Uh, some guys have got their Xboxes here and stuff too. So, um, and we've had meetings and stuff to, all day too. So you don't you don't get too bored here. There's plenty to do. While the team looks to check off another box, players and coaches seek to enjoy quality time with one another before the journey commences once again. I mean, the culture that we have is uh, pretty incredible. Um, you know, we're all a close team. Um, we share a lot of laughs together every day, including the coaches. Uh, you know, they, they're definitely a part of the team as well. Um, but at the same time, uh, when it has to be business, you know, it's straight business. And uh, we do a good job of all of that, I think. And yeah, uh, we're just a very close team. And uh, I think it kind of pays for it on the ice. much I haven't played basketball in a while but uh, it's nice to just come out here and uh, get in the sun for a bit and we're all pretty competitive so it was nice to uh, to get that win. Uh, who, who would you say has like the worst shooting form on the team? Uh, I'd have to say Pete's up there he looks like Peter Pan when he shoots the ball so 